Wanna quit, boy, that's the day I dread Same day I quit, is the same day I'm dead And the shorties like my flow, it's like the snow I'm too cold with it, Jack is in my phone, they trying to know Good morning, chapter night Woo-hoo! Going on, boys Welcome to another episode of the Almost a Man podcast Welcome to the show We are back, boys And black Yeah, we are <laughs> Maybe just not all of us <laughs> Whoa, whoa, Maddie, whoa. We can't say that anymore because we're filming. <laughs> <laughs> we got our man, Lukey, our first uh, crowd. What up, what up? <laughs> <laughs> Hype boy. Yeah, my man. Hey, we've got a fucking awesome show lined up today. Our man, ZD, baby, Xander Digital. How's it going, lads? How's it going? Yeah. 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 Let's go. Bam, so I'm trying to find it. Uh, <laughs> Let's, go. Let's, go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Lost it, brother. <laughs> Bro, it's not even here anymore. What's going on? Anyway. Good. How are you, brother? Yeah, good, man. Good, yeah. What about you, lads? How you going? <laughs> yeah, we're good, bro. <laughs> 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 just turn the Murray up. <laughs> I've been, ha- I've been having to be real wide around these fellas lately. Come <laughs> on. <laughs> We in here now, you're flat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with all of my people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's mad. Nah, we got good chats on today. Oh, yeah. Oh, Alex. Yeah. Uh, Alex. Yeah, you we said were- Xander Digital, you didn't introduce his name. Xander Digital. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's it, that's all. That's all you need to know. ZD, baby. Like Superman. Got the merch on, brother. Oh, yeah, bro. So Matthew and I went to school with Alex and uh, yeah, it's been awesome to see his uh, music career popping and also his previous career mm. and yeah, so we're going to dive into that today. Um, talk, t- talk us through Gordon Vale State High School, the place yeah, to be. Throw, throw us back no, to like, the beginning. God's country. <laughs> hey. no, it, was, um, it was crazy, like I started with a... Like when I got in grade eight with a completely different sort of group, yeah, and then ended with a with another completely different group. So it was really interesting. And what I just think people just leaving and shit? Or? As then you yeah, started people. off with nerds and then ended up in the cool gang. Ended up with the boys. I was a nerd. <laughs> I was hanging. I was hanging around with all the black fellas at the start, <laughs> and then I was hanging around Maddie at the end. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was good, it was good. <laughs> ah, no, it was good. <laughs> no, yeah, so, yeah, so it was interesting sort of looking at that chapter because that's what it was. I like to look at my life in chapters and high school was like a pretty defining chapter. But, like, things are so different now. And um, But school really did set me up, you know, for, for the years to come, which was, like, I'm really happy for my school years. They were really good, yeah. But, um, yeah, Gordy. Were you smart? Oh, uh, <laughs> he was <laughs> at me at the end. <laughs> I tried. I tried really hard. I tried really hard, but um, I just had trouble learning in the sort of the classrooms. That that, that sort of format just wasn't yeah. for me. Yeah. And um, like yeah, I remember I was like, I was one of the only Indigenous kids that was doing um, what's it like maths? Eh? Like the yeah, okay. Like, be eligible. Maths. Holy, I was doing pre voc. <laughs> <laughs> me it's too. With the, <laughs> with the rest <laughs> of the mob. <laughs> I was the only I was the only black fellow left, so I thought like I had to had to stay there and tough it out, and I just really really didn't want to uh, want to fail because I wanted to sort of prove something. Yeah. yeah. So um, oh, nice. and yeah, you remember Mr. Cole Hart from school? Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah but I remember. I remember when Mr. Cole Hart was like, "Okay, Cole like, Cole Hart, yeah. <laughs> hard on my heels." <laughs> anyway, anyway, it was like, like a sort of crossroads, and he was like. Man, like you get one C minus for the rest of the year. I remember it was like, it was like fucking January. It was, like, <laughs> <laughs> it was in the Christmas holidays. It was like fucking May. And he's like, bro, like you get one more C minus. Like you cannot get a C minus. Like you know, pretty much. And like, well, don't give you, me one then, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Slip, slide you got a cold heart. Table, bro. <laughs> he's like, bro, like you're not getting your QCE, pretty much. Ooh. Holy. So like that was probably the first time that like. I sort of put everything on myself, like, you know, bet everything all on black, you know, on Church. me. Church. Church. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first time I, was, I sort of really, you know, put put everything on me. And yeah. it was like it was make or break, you know. And 
pulled through and ended up, yeah, you know, passing, which is really, really good. And, um, and yeah, it's something I'm really proud of as well. Yeah. Yeah, big ups to that, man. Yeah, yeah good shit, because I didn't do maths, eh? I did pre voc. Math A is hard. You'd be getting C minuses yeah, yeah, and pre voc. That's why you're sitting there. <laughs> 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 I'm about to edit your voice out Every episode from now on Is this, is this muted? Don't stop me <laughs> As my dad used to say Gonna break a leg to shake a leg Gonna oh, <laughs> oh, break a leg to shake a leg <laughs> That's, That's so form, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I had a I had a bit of a run in with That said teacher I'm not gonna say really? his name Yeah he um. Oh, I already said his name. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, that's good. I'm not gonna say it. But Allegedly, we're we're talking about the same teacher. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, uh, year twelve, I was in. I was. It was a bit hard for me at school because I was I was actually school captain with your sister. Oh, yeah. Sounds hard. Yeah. But then the guy in school. <laughs> so I was school captain, but then my grades did not reflect me being a school captain. So I was in a bit of a pickle. Pr- pickle. Yeah. Some would say a pickle. And uh, yeah, I was doing maths with said teacher. <laughs> cold, cold. Uh, <laughs> is that what you don't say? I was singing every time. <laughs> 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 no, that guy's still well. going, bro. He's still going. He's still going. <laughs> Just point at me if you want to say his name. <laughs> <laughs> and it was, yeah, it come to the end of the year 12, and I, I was just getting through, like, just passing. And he, he said this, he still remembers this so clearly. He said this to me in front of the whole class and it proper just made me feel like a piece of shit. True. He goes, what do you want to do when you leave school? And this was, I was sort of already toying up the idea being a lecky. And he goes, I said, oh, I want to be an electrician. He goes, you won't be an electrician. You're not smart enough. In front of the whole fucking class, bro. True. Yeah. You just throat punch that cunt. Look at me now, ho. Look at me now, ho. <laughs> Oh man, I can't I'm getting it. papers. Is it's hard yeah. enough trying to go through um, high school with the limitations you put on yourself. You know? Yeah, bro. And it, it takes a while. Like later on, you're like, oh, I could have done so much more if mm. I, you know. But like, let alone like a teacher, you know, they they got such a tough job. You know, they're not just like teaching you um, like said subjects. They're like trying to build you as a human. They're trying to set you up to walk into a bloody society. Yeah. You, not, you know, you're the butt of the joke that way because he's sitting at home. Listening to this girl, <laughs> that's what I meant. Oh, true. <laughs> <laughs> he got you, man. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> you should have become a plumber. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, that, he's, that was my plan the whole, the whole time. <laughs> my plan along. <laughs> oh, nah, man. fuck him. <laughs> nah, fuck him. <laughs> oh, man. So you left school because obviously this show almost meant podcast i was gonna say project man <laughs> I'm, I'm, thinking, oh, I'm thinking school too Ooh. much Ooh, are we forming into that Almost a man project. project because i mean a project project or project project pro- pros project pro in it yeah. shut up maddie <laughs> <laughs> you say projector <laughs> <laughs> so the whole base behind the show is for younger lads and ladies fucking shut up you two is to Listen along. You know, they might be a bit lost. They don't know what they want to do when they leave school. And basically, this show is a form of guidance. So they can listen to interesting stories like your story or our previous episodes and go, you know what, maybe that's sort of what I'm looking at, but then I might want to do this. And, and that's that's the whole whole idea of the show and as a bit people, of guidance. Yeah, as people will hear this too, your story... Isn't going to be the same as anyone else's as well. Exactly right. Which is mm. pretty sick about what we're doing, sort of. Yeah, thing. and yeah. you might inspire. There might be someone at school listening, thinking exact same, and they might. Oh, I'm not good enough to be writing fat fucking tunes like he does. <laughs> <laughs> nice I role like model that. already, I though. Like we're, yeah, we're, f- we're five minutes in, nine minutes in, mm. and he's done math. A eh? black fella. Chooch, chuchi, <laughs> chuchi, <laughs> chuchi. He's, I'm he's that always said that. Right? <laughs> I like it. So yeah, what what were you sort of what what was your thought process of leaving school? Because it's a daunting time in oh, anyone's 100%. life. Yeah, I think my whole life I've just sort of like like go with the flow, and I'm lucky that it served me well. You know, a lot of other people 
with that mindset, it mightn't work, but for me, it really did. And um, I know it grinded my mum's gears. It grinded, you know, people trying to coach you, you know, career coaches in school and stuff. Like, you know, you have meetings with people. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, that grinded their gears because I was just like, oh, I don't know what I really want to do. And if I don't know what to do, I'll join Navy. And they're telling me, oh, it's not that easy, mate. You know, you've got to actually plan to join the Navy, like, you know. No, and, they um, come to you, bro. <laughs> what? <laughs> bro, they come to you. I have a witness, bro. Knocking at the door. <laughs> Serve us. We want you to <laughs> jump on a fucking boat and rot away. <laughs> That's an Instagram clip right there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, that's sick. Uh, but yeah, yeah. So like, mum didn't like how sort of laissez faire was. Just chill back, lay back, go with the flow. And I was, I was struggling like for the first year, you know. But I had that cushion room of like, you know, people saying like, "Oh, gap year, gap year." Gap year. <laughs> so I was, I was lucky. I had that, you know. <clears throat> so yeah, after after that um, time was sort of. Ending, I was like, oh, geez, like, you know, I've got to, I've got to do something, you know. So I ended up doing like a, um, it's like a navy program. So you're like in the navy, but it's like an indigenous program. Sure, and, um <laughs> <laughs> It was like an indigenous <laughs> program, but um, you it goes for like six months, and like I hated it, hated it. I was uh-huh. in. They just locked us in like um, our dorms, pretty much for six months. We weren't allowed to see our family. It was horrible. What? Racist. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah. And um, I've seen this before. <laughs> 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 Fuck it out. Hey, 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 say that. I've seen this, <laughs> bro, bro. <laughs> I was, I, was, I was about to gloss over and keep going, but I had to, I had to lean back on my chair and learn how to pick my own. Anyway, thanks for having oh, me, boys. <laughs> oh, that's so good. But um, I've seen this before. <laughs> but um, but yeah, yeah, like sort of. So that wasn't a really good run in. So everyone else chose to sort of join the navy after that properly through general entry. So um, but I was just like, nah, it's not for me. So I think that's a like a pretty good. I, I like that as a story, sort of like, oh, I tried it. I thought it wasn't for me. I left for a year afterwards. I did like all sorts of jobs. Like you know, I was like. What was I doing? I was working at the butchers. I was like, I was like working at the Green Hill Banana Farm. <laughs> oh fuck me! So hey, you, you want to know skin how a beast and skin a banana? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <chut. laughs> hey. See, that's how black fellas do it. Not touchy. <laughs> that's my white rendition of it. No, I like it, I like it. I Add like a bit it. of spice. You've literally done that since the first time we met. Because yeah. <laughs> I've always said, chooch. <laughs> you always change that, chooch. Chooch. <laughs> I like it, man. It's I like you're like trying it. to call you small dog here. Chooch, come here. Oh, if someone gets a dog, please name it Chooch. Oh, please. yeah, 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 yeah. 100%, please. 100%, 100%. Send it in. Um, send the dog in. <laughs> send, the, send the dog in. We'll send do a dog. podcast with it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Almost the man of the podcast, bloody mascot. Chuchi, <laughs> <laughs> dog. Bro, that's awesome. Oh, man. But, um, so I was doing all this stuff for like a year and then pretty much I started like approaching the big two zero, you know? No. Mm. And I was like, oh, fuck. Like, yeah. you know, what does that mean? Like 2020, the year? No, like 20, 20 years old. Uh. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is like... I, you sort of had to look at what you're achieving, like where your life's sort of heading. Well, that's what I did anyway. It's like I sort of couldn't hide behind anything. It was just a little quick reality check. And I was like, uh, like I don't like where where my life is right now, you know. And I know I'm going to piss off a lot of people <laughs> by like joining the Navy again after for so long saying it wasn't for me, you know. Oh, <clears> yeah. So I was just like. Come crawling back. I was like, fuck it. You know, going to do it. And um, and mum was like, "See, I told you, just stay there." But you got everyone has to go through their own evolution. And yeah, like, that's right. Yeah. That was something I had to figure out myself. You yeah, know? I said this isn't for me. Got out, did a year, you know, working some shit jobs. And I was like, you know what? Fuck this. <laughs> I'd rather be locked up. You know, <laughs> I'd rather be I'd rather be locked up in bloody detention. In detention. In detention. But um, <laughs> so I was like, let's give it a crack. And then that's what started my five and a half. Year career in Navy, yeah. Oh man, that's a yeah. long time too. It's an apprenticeship plus a year, mm. if I'm not mistaken. I like did probably sixty sixty percent of that was just out at sea as well, oh, on really? deployment as well. Yeah, 
Yeah. So you get seasick? Was that? You get seasick? No, nah, I, I was lucky. I, I don't. But you'd be surprised how many people in the Navy get seasick. Yeah. hundred percent. When Bro. I tell people, they go, what? That should be like, like the first test. It's like, yeah. it's like a box that you tick. Like, do yeah. you get seasick? And like, do you know what you're signing up for? And yeah. like, yeah, nah, man. You see people chucking up their guts on the back. Put it on the boat. The boat. I didn't sign up for this. <laughs> <laughs> what the, dis- the fuck? <laughs> the disappointment in Wrong my... Wrong army. <laughs> <laughs> End of it. Nah, I want to dig holes in the desert. What the fuck is this? <laughs> 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 oh man yeah. So what did you go in the Navy as? What was your so, role? <clears throat> that's a funny story as well Like I was just trying to be like I wanted to be like a firefighter In the fucking Air Force In the water Simply because In the water <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Pretty easy a job eh? <laughs> yeah, Pretty good job actually Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fuck themselves out <laughs> Those fucking fires No but um I wanted to be a firefighter In the Air Force And um Turned out like that was. So you're not scared of heights either. Uh, I don't. I don't like spending time at heights. You know? Well, that's why you're in the navy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's why I was in the navy. Now, nah, yeah. <clears throat> so I, I pitched that, and they're like, "Oh, yeah, yeah, it's all good, all good." And I told them like, "Oh, like, pretty much from the get go, like, I don't want anything like too technical." And that's exactly what they fucking put me in. <laughs> so, like, We've got the perfect job be, for you. <laughs> I wanted to be like a, what was it, like a cook in the Navy. Skin and or, cows. Or <laughs> and bananas. Skin yeah. and beef. <laughs> Steak you and bananas. You want to skin some bananas in the Navy? <laughs> <laughs> in the Navy. Nah, um, yeah, so I want to be a cook or a firefighter. Yeah, okay. And what they ended up putting me in was like, so the job title is um, Hydrographic Systems Operator. Yeah, that sounds oh. fucking technical. Let's yeah. Guess, yeah. Let's, <laughs> shall we guess what that means? Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. say it reckon, again. Say well, it I again. I already know I what it means. I feel, so like, you I feel like you... Yeah, yeah, I know what it means. Do you get um, this in COD? Are you cheating? No. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was in COD, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's so much easier. <laughs> definitely not in COD. Um, yeah, Prestige hi- that hydrographic, motherfucker. Hydrographic Systems Operator. Hydrographic. Hydro is water. Graphic is graphs. Computers. So, so basically, you, you're a, you map the sea. 100%. Mm-hmm. Fuck. Ah, yeah. We got there together. No, we didn't. It was just me. <laughs> 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 I didn't think that was going to happen. Eh? I, seen, I seen that Valentine's post, eh, boys? <laughs> <laughs> I seen that post. That now one. kiss. <laughs> now kiss. <laughs> yes, yeah, so you, you map it. Because a lot of the Navy's work, correct me if I'm wrong, a lot of the Navy's work is is doing mapping. Is that right? Um. Mapping the ocean floor for submarines. <laughs> Looking back for those Russians. Don't look at me like that. No, no, no. He looked at me like, you fucking idiot. <laughs> no, no, you're, you're, you're onto something now. I was, I was figuring out how much I should talk about. Um, but I think it depends on the job title. Like, there's everything. The main... The main job that we do is like pretty much border security. We do border. Yeah. Borders are big. And um, like so op resolute stuff like, you know, boardings and boat people. Oh, um, yeah. So mine's just like a little sort of niche sort of branch of the of the Navy. Is that how you say that word? Niche. Niche. I've only seen it in porn. <laughs> 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 yeah, right. Insta oh, clip. Good ways. <laughs> good ways. <laughs> Edit that out. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, like, um, yeah, yeah. So what we do is like we're the only branch in the Navy that actually makes money for the Navy. Oh, really? really? So yeah, we actually sell all the charts that we make. Oh, fuck. To, um, to like all the, everyone around the world. Like surveyors and whatnot. Yeah, so surveyors yeah. and, uh, but like just for the safety of like merchant ships and stuff. Yeah. So we'll. I like this language, eh? <laughs> it kind of sound like you were boarding boats and selling their goods on the market or something. No, 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 no. That'll be five uh, shillings. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Jack Sparrow. <laughs> it's Captain Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Captain Black Sparrow. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, I love it. No, yeah, yeah. Um, so that's that. Imagine yeah. if... So what was that one called? Hydro, hydrographic... Hydrographic... <laughs> I can't even say it, bro. Yeah. What's the new, mate? You stopped me up, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, hydrographic systems operator. Imagine if they had a name like that, like hydrochloride weapons inspector. And all you're, all you're doing is cleaning the missiles. <laughs> so, so you do it. All you're doing is kissing the missiles before they fight. <laughs> Good luck. Goodbye, my babies. <laughs> Have fun oh. in China. Oh. 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 
<laughs> cut that Christ. out. Just cut that out. <laughs> no, I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, a famous part. You got any other Navy stories you want to touch on before we get into work fuck ups? Um, like what? What was the training like? So training. I listened to to uh, Foxit Liss's one as well. It's very <laughs> interesting. I, what I will say is I was like. Navy was like fucking three push ups. <laughs> yeah, yeah, probably ragged you out, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Well, this but, is your time to get him back. Yeah. Yeah, well, I've actually. Armies of pussies. <laughs> I've actually done overseas deployments, you know? Fuck. Oh! <laughs> I've served my country. <laughs> oh. No, no. No, no. Shots we, fired. we talk about it all the time. Literally. No, Literally. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Well, I think stop doing something. that. Stop doing that. I think he said something like, like it was like. Like three push ups. Oh, he said something like nine push ups. I had to do like twenty five push ups, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's like eighteen more. <laughs> it was like it was like to a. It was like, <laughs> it was like to a cadence, so it's a thousand times more harder as well. See, when you pump them out, it's like heaps easy, but like they go like oh, you up, lift your arms down. Up. Oh, and, and like, like hold it, hold up, down. So you had to get to twenty five like that. Oof. I couldn't so, do yeah. five right now. We won't get Not you enough there. room. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Luckily. Yeah. Luckily. Yeah. I was looking at the real status, wasn't well, though. I wasn't looking at your dinner. I was looking at the <laughs> space. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. Um, so what's it? Uh, Cerberus. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, Cerberus. So we did, um, was it three months? Three months at Cerberus. And being black fella from Cairns, <clears throat> you know, I was born in the in the islands, you know, so you said hot I went there in winter, <laughs> so it was like fucking negative one degrees. Holy. The sidewards rain every day, so you put on your cap to try like stop the rain. And, and a kangaroo I'd, like, skin. Angle it, I'd angle it, I'll angle that hat like that, bro. Can't see. And it still go and hit my forehead, and just like, bro. Only black fire to get windburn. Yeah, man. Yeah, bro. No, it was crazy, bro. So yeah, did three months there, and then after that, and that was just like physical training. A bunch of shooting, a um, bit of sailing training, tying knots and whatnot. Do you shoot guns in the Navy? Yeah, Is yeah, that, yeah. like, part of the basic training? Basic training, everyone has to, like, learn how to shoot an F-88 style. That's, like, the, that's the basic um, basic gun. Yeah. And um, and as you progress, like, depending on what you do, you, you can learn other guns and stuff, yeah. So I did. I, I picked up 9mm in my time. Ooh. I was trained in the 9mm weapon. Oh, hey. That was cool. I these know two, exactly how big a 9mm is. These two boys has got a chubby. <laughs> Listen to that. Yeah, yeah. Probably cod nerds, eh? This one, these fellas is bricked up. <laughs> <laughs> Matty's walking out of the fucking studio with look like a fucking half cock pocket knife. <laughs> 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 uh, Matty uh, over at our starboard bow over here. <laughs> 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 you got a right too, this fella. You got a right too. You got it right, yeah, bro. You got it right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's our thing. <laughs> <laughs> jealous, jealous. No, no, I had to, I had to. You like that? Yeah, that's fair. Um, but yeah, no, it was good. And then we did. Um, so after that, three months in Cerberus, did uh, another three months in Sydney doing a hydrography course. Yeah, so that was gnarly. Yeah. Hi, hi, are we going to guess that too? It's the same hydrography. Same, same oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of the same. Training for the Bro. job. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you. <laughs> we were just talking about. It. I bet you'd still guess it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> What was it? What was it? It comes in a tank at Ken's wholesale paint. <laughs> <laughs> so so the, the training in its own, like Ethan sort of told us it was pretty brutal for the army boys. Did you get it a bit softer or what? Yeah, I know. Um, I, I can't compare it to the army. Or is he just I, I to tell out. us his talk? No, yeah. no. I definitely, I definitely think it's um, army's a lot more like you have to be fit. Like, you know. Yeah. So, yeah. I... Just by default, I think theirs was probably a, a bit more intense. But I think you got to run and swim, though. Ours, yeah, ours wasn't too far behind. I, th- I don't think like we did horrible things. Like it was, it was crazy. Like we'd wake up at like four a.m. in the morning, and like um, you have literally like one minute to be like from dead sleep dreaming about cans <laughs> <laughs> to be like dressed like in the, per- in, the in the perfect rig wow. outside like and and standing what? up. Yeah, like one minute, and like, and like one minute, you, you're you're a bag of shit. Like everything that you're wearing is wrong. So he just walk around and he'd say, "That's wrong, that's wrong, wrong hat." And wrong. He, like, he would count up all the things, and then he'd make you like, like um, hold wall squats for like, you know, like thirty minutes. Oh. After like doing like just 
like you know squats and like running. It was just horrible. Holy! And that sounds IG's horrible. Good fight. So it's <laughs> worse than the army. Yeah, and we had this. Um, it was like this whistle training, pretty much, and we were like just running around this oval. And whenever you blew blew the whistle twice, you had to sprint. And he was watching everyone, so it's like you know people weren't faster than others, but you know so if there were stragglers, you could see them. And if you weren't sprinting um, until he said stop, like you know everyone would have to hold a plank. And, oh. it was, you know, <laughs> and like and it's designed for you know the weakest link to obviously take a rest, and you always holding planks. And oh. so that was crazy. It's like you know four a.m. in the morning, negative one degrees, super cold. It's crazy, yeah. Yeah, That's I, remember, I remember that shit at footy, and I would always be like to the faster boys, slow down. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. I made it a point to become really good friends with them, so that <laughs> they slow down. Yeah. Hey, yeah, hey, yo, hey. yo, yo, we're not starting this again. Slow the fuck down. Whoa. Act like you're running. Yeah, <laughs> fucking woo up, boys. And, um, woo up. We had we had like some of the. They talk about like old. They call it old navy. It's like with that hectic like. Owen. <laughs> yeah, they call it old old navy pretty much like when Isn't that like, a brand? When they were allowed to like abuse you and stuff, like you know, like oh, yeah. properly like call like personalized like shit talking. Yeah. Now they have to like it has to be broad. Oh, you know? okay. So like, they can yeah. still do it, but <clears throat> Yeah, yeah, but we were sort of the last intake that they were just like anything's free game. And it was Ooh. just like New Blood <laughs> Meets back on the menu, boys. <laughs> yeah, it was it was fuck like this one like person who was like a bit overweight, you know. I was like doing this run, and we're all cheering him, like yeah, 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 because like, we were all finished, like and well before, like you know, well before him, we all waiting for him, and he's like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> he's like, this is a sub sub par fitness test. You shouldn't be straining like he is. He's like, he's failed. Never, never commend failure. <clears throat> he's like, wow. he's going, like it's going all out, <clears throat> and he goes up to his face. I remember it. It was like this is gnarly, and he's like, <laughs> what is that? It's it's so fucked. I laugh because it's so fucked. You know, he goes. If I couldn't run, um, if I couldn't run two two and a half k's in twelve minutes, I'd fucking kill myself. And he said that to Holy. the to the bloke's like face, like this far away from him. And, and I remember I was just like, "Oh my god!" You know, let's say that now he would have got cancelled. Hundred percent. Sorry, sir. Yeah. <laughs> that's, so, sorry, chief. That's not, <laughs> that's not bad moving, but <clears throat> yeah, two and a half k in twelve minutes. Yeah, yeah. So you have to you have to be pretty pretty quick on the feet. Yeah. Fuck, that's moving, man. That's that's for the blokes. When he was doing push-ups, was he going, one, tub it, tub it. <laughs> two, tub it, tub it. Two, tub it, tub it. Oh, man. Oh, no, and that same bloke, man, because if you, if you can't pass the fitness test, you get back-classed. So, um, yeah, it was crazy. So he'd been back-classed multiple times because he couldn't pass the fitness test. So he was there for like a year just, oh. trying, to pass, just trying to pass recruit school, man. Three man shake. And, and he was on his what last on? one, and, and we, were, we were there. And um, <clears throat> I remember I was standing at the back with him, and because the chief was all at the front, like there's like 200 people doing this fitness, you know, sort of, sort of test. And anyway, we're doing this like uh, squat sort of warm up. It's a squat hold. He says warm up, but it's like, you know, it's a proper exercise. And you have to hold this. Yeah, squat. Legs. <laughs> yeah, exactly, man. And you like legs shaking, bro. And this fellow was standing next to me, and he was just like standing up straight. And I was like, oh man, you, I was just standing next to me, like I'm trying to hide at the back here. And sure enough, that chief seeing him, he's like, oh, I won't see. I'll, Come up with a fake name. Uh, he was like, Chieftain. He's like, fucking Kyle. He's like, I'm sick and tired of seeing your face here. You know, I want you out of here. Boy. Is this Fat Kyle? <laughs> yeah, Fat Kyle. <laughs> fat Kyle. It was, like, it was like, Big ups, Fat Kyle. He was like, I want you out of here. I'm sick of seeing your face. Oh, sorry, one. Yeah, yeah. It's like, I, I want you out. He's like saying stuff like that. Just, and I'm right next to well, him. Well, just pass me then. <laughs> and I was like, oh, because like, I, I was holding a shit squad as well, but it wasn't as bad as it is. But like, yeah, so I was like just trying to put my head down. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, bro. I was just putting my head down like, don't look at me, man. But yeah, nah, so it's good. it was pretty brutal. And then yeah. we had like biathlons and stuff. So you had to like run for like... For, it like, sounds like it's more than the army. Sorry, Fox Atlas. Yeah. <laughs> so we run like 8Ks and then you had to swim um, like, it was like a... 700 metres, and that was brutal. Mm. Yeah. Did they put you in any, like, situations? Like, did they put you in a fucking ship that's, like, sinking or anything? Or yeah, yeah, anything yeah. like that? Yeah, 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 100%. They had, like, this, um, they call it four S's. Don't ask me what the four S's stand for. <laughs> I don't know. It sounds like a good holding <laughs> Commodore to me. <laughs> 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 no, but yeah, so, and you're in this simulation. So we, like, fighting fires, like, fake fires and stuff. And, um... <laughs> But they like actually had the fire there. It was pretty pretty crazy. And then they had like a room that would flood, 
And if you didn't do the right techniques, then the room would just keep on flooding until it got like, they'd say like, you know, as a safety measure, it will not flood like, you know, you'll have you'll be like that with Yo! Oh. <laughs> I wouldn't be anywhere near that. So the first one you had an option, like it was a passable level. Like if you if you were good enough, quick enough, you could stop the leak, you know? Yeah. Whereas the other one's like, we want you to try hard and they didn't tell you that like you was you were set up for failure. They wanted to see how you go. So I should have seen it coming because they were really telling us like, Oh yeah, if you get to the top they're teaching us how to like float and like you know, how many men did you lose that year? <laughs> no, how many men? Yeah. <laughs> no, like, and, and yeah, pretty much couldn't stop it. Still trying. And once it gets above your waist, you can't do anything. So, yeah, we just floated and went up to the top. Yeah. Oh, that is. I can't float. I have eh? nightmares of that, eh? Like yeah, dying. Yeah, it's it like crazy, that. man. It was That'd crazy. be the worst at sea. Cool. It was no light as well. So it was like pretty crazy. Oh. Yeah, man. And what do they do? Like, they go. Right, I sim the elations over, drain the tank. Sort yeah, of yeah. They, <laughs> they drain the tank a little bit so any, everyone can stand. Oh, and yeah. And then we like. There's like a little sort of window you hop out and then they drain it fully. Yeah. I'd dive down, pull that plug out. <laughs> yeah, 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 right. Fast, Innovation. fast. <laughs> That's thinking, see? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, lucky, they train you pretty good. Like I've had a, had to fight a couple of real fires out at sea and that was pretty scary. Yeah. Machinery fires because there's no one else out there to help you. Like you have to put these things out. And a right. couple of... Uh, like real, real ones, not like... Yeah, oh, like real. Him, yeah, like an actual fire. Actual, yeah. So, like, the day I got passed out, they, they call it getting passed out. So, like, when you're like, okay, you can hold yeah, duties up on the fridge. Out. <laughs> Pass out. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah. So, like, when you're like, okay, yeah, you're, you're all good. You don't need someone staring over your shoulder, like, on the bridge. Um, you know, you know how to fight all these fake fires. I'm re- pretty sure you can fight a real one. The day that I got ticked off, like, a real one happened. <laughs> Holy! But like, yeah, like it was all fresh in my brain. Did Kyle start so it? Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle's not in the name. I'm burning this motherfucker. Did he not pass? I'm gonna make the fucking cut. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, one Kyle. Yeah, sorry, one Kyle. Hey, what's he doing now? Uh, in the sure, army. I'm, I'm pretty sure he's a chef in City Street. Yeah. Oh yeah. So keep up with him. Yeah. Yeah. Big ups, Kyle. <laughs> Those who can't navy, chef. <laughs> Oh, the chef's getting triggered right now. <laughs> 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 Better not, though. They're not a sharpen it. Not them fellas. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, nah. So I had a couple of real bees, a couple of toxic hazards. Were pretty crazy. Yeah, some irrespirable atmospheres. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Mm. And you know how to Naughty. fight toxic hazards online now. Toxic hazards online now. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Did we just uh, was that a nice little bridge way to the? Yeah, yeah <laughs> okay. we'll go yeah. streamer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we're out with that. <laughs> in my holding. <laughs> <laughs> in my holding. I've been. Um, am I? I don't know if I'm allowed to ask this. We'll, we'll cut it out. What's your nationality, if you don't mind? Yeah, yeah. I'm bloody indigenous, and I'm from Torres Strait. Yeah, Torres Strait Islander. TSI. Yeah, TSI. My man, see. <laughs> Torres yeah, Strait. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, I was telling him I was born in TI, and he's like, oh yeah, but what island? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. oh no, that's Thursday Island. <laughs> yeah, that's Thursday Island. <laughs> yeah, <it's a> silent. <laughs> yeah, so, yes. <laughs> no, yeah, and um, Aboriginal side is from Gulf of Carpentaria, I found out. Yeah. You're both? Yeah, yeah. Me too. Yeah. Hey, hey cousin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cousins with Matty Bowen too, probably. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, everyone, is, story. Right, everyone is. Everyone is. Everyone is. Funny story. Funny story. I claim him. I claim it. Yeah. Second cousins. I'll count that. No. <laughs> I need That's proof, bro. My grandma has the same grandma as his grandma. <laughs> 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 I was following you too, yeah. and then the extra grandma is like, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm logging off on that conversation. <laughs> Laugh it up, Whitey. Can't <laughs> 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 give it back. <laughs> I got some black up this time. <laughs> Looking at the camera. <laughs> yeah. We are filming this. <laughs> no, that's sick. Um, yeah, so you've had an incredible experience with the Navy. Yeah, man, yeah, it's been good. Travelled everywhere. No, it's been really good to me. Got, got, a, got a house out of it as well. Uh, yeah, nice. With that. Holy. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. yeah it's good. Does it fill up with water? <laughs> <laughs> no, your house wakes up at 4 a.m. <laughs> Just not testing a. you. Not, six not, months not if in. I call it right, bro. Six months in, wake up. <laughs> 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 Breathing <laughs> techniques. <laughs> <laughs> the mermaid hey, swim. 6 p.m., alarm goes up. I'm looking at my fucking fan. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> you have one minute to get dressed. <laughs> good to see you're still floating, Xander. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh. End of exercise. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, where where have you been with the navy? What sort yeah, of yeah? Oh, so I've been to some cool places. Like, so I will say before navy, like most, like the other place I've only been to before the navy was fucking Dowsel, you know. <laughs> So Big ups. So, so nah, fuck Townsville. <laughs> yeah, fuck Brownsville. No. <laughs> no, no. That's the only other place that I've been to. So when I joined Navy, yeah, the first trip I went to was a really good one. Went to the Philippines. Went to a place called Palau. That was sick. Like best um, snorkeling that I've ever done in my life. It was crazy. Like best reefs and stuff. Were they crazy? Isn't that crazy? Were they crazy? Isn't that crazy? crazy? Oh. <laughs> 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 Yeah, that's right. that's so good. I haven't got that's one so in a good. long time. It's all right. <laughs> the buzzer, the buzzer. That's so good. Um, yeah, I've been to Sri Lanka. I've uh, been to all over Malaysia, Langkawi, Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Um, what else have I been? I've been to Indonesia, Jakarta, capital of Indonesia. That was cool. Um, and I've been to the islands of Micronesia. That's out east. It's like all these little. Islands and stuff. There's not much on there. All for these like random deployments, random missions, like that the government would send us on. Are much. they like week long trips to get there? <coughs> yeah, yeah. Or some we of like them, talking days. Uh, some of them we're talking about like two weeks. Yeah, to get Ooh. to Sri Lanka. Yeah, it's um, it's the most west that a um hydrographic ship's ever been was, and I was on that trip, so that was pretty cool. Big yeah. Yamaha outboard or what? <laughs> yeah, big one, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. Full start, bro. Oh. <laughs> Two strike. He was running up the ship like <laughs> Fuck, didn't get it, boys. Run starboard, home. go starboard. <laughs> oh, <that's sick. laughs> big fucking javelin, bro. Staring with a big fucking big javelin. Oh, man. But yeah, nah, so some amazing, cool places, yeah. And Singapore, Singapore is my... Yeah, Singapore my looks favorite. sick, eh? Hey? Yeah, man. Do you, so you, you get days off in these mm. places? Yeah, you get like a um, couple of days if you're if you're not on duty. So yeah. Someone's got to hold the gangway, like yeah, hold yeah. security and stuff. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. Gang, gang, gang. <laughs> no, yeah. Um, but if you're, if, you're <laughs> not, <laughs> if you're not on the gangway, then you can just, yeah, you can just press. good. Yeah. Mata press guy. Yeah. That's yeah. sick. So out at sea, have you ever scanned something like unusual in the water, like a submarine or anything like that? Like, or has it just been normal? U- Sometimes, USO? Yeah. I, I've, I've seen a lot of crazy, weird stuff. Like we found wrecks randomly, like um, shipwrecks. And yeah, we're right. like, what the fuck is that? So if it doesn't pop up on the map, then it's something like we've just discovered that day. So like I've, I've discovered a couple of those. And because we have like some of the best resolution sort of technology on the... <coughs> on the old uh, ships, you can really see a lot. So um, we plot them and then um, they'll probably set another mission aside to scan that and figure out what it is. Make sure it's got some time. gold on it or something. Mm. Yeah, it might be. A bit of Loch Ness Monster. Loch Ness <laughs> Monster. What's the button? <laughs> button yourself. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> no, yeah. No, yeah. And yeah, just some. Some other crazy stuff. Like we, one time we were leaving, um, should I say it? Oh, if you're going to get in trouble, you don't have to say it, mate. Oh, I, I'm out now. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Next minute, Jocko's knocking on the door. <laughs> no, I won't say the, like, just, like, I won't say the country, but we were in FBI a... just texted me. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're in a country and um, the commanding officer was supposed to get like approval to survey in these certain waters. <clears throat> and um, as we're getting off the wharf, like the, I will say the the commanding officer was like not very professional, and like he was just like everyone was saying he was like drunk the whole port visit where we were. Oh, really? <clears throat> yeah. Well, you drink time. rum if you're on the ship, yeah, eh? Typical sailor. Yep. <laughs> Especially if you go on shipwreck cove. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> as we're as we're leaving the side of the wharf, he was like trying to get approval, like pretty much to oh, to survey wow. in their country's waters. And he's like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's all sorted. It's like thumbs up and stuff. And he's like, well, righto. Anyway, we're serving. I'm going to need this on paper. <laughs> thumbs up. <laughs> thumbs up. We'll do on Facebook, champ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and anyway, we're, we're cruising along. The next thing you know, there's this massive, like, destroyer, like, following oh, us. Oh, Jesus. And oh, like, shit. And, and they start getting, like, into... So there's certain rules that you have to follow in, like, for maritime safety. Like, moving of vessels and stuff. 
So we're like, okay, it's dangerous now. So we <clears throat> pull out the nine millimeter. We made um we made contact with them. <laughs> And I'm like, hey, like, what are you doing pretty much? Like, what are your intentions? And they said, like, you're not allowed to survey here. Like, you need to leave. Like, get out of here. And he said, oh, no, we have approval. They tried to talk us their way out of it. <clears throat> but, um, no, they pretty much um, staunched us out of there. They had, they had all their, like, cannons ready to go. All their like, boys up on the deck, no shirts on like this. You'll be surveying <laughs> heaven in a second. <laughs> this Tencent. No, yeah, so that that was pretty crazy. That was, that was gnarly because, yeah, survey boats don't have a – whole lot of like firepower on them we're just you know data gatherers pretty much we, we do have some but not nothing compared to that thing that so they know like, we're gonna pummel this ship <laughs> and yeah. i was i yeah. love looking at them i was like this could be the last thing i fucking see man like it's crazy True. yeah and then um so we're like we ended up agreeing we're like okay okay we'll get out of your waters you know and they followed us for like two days like making oh, sure that's even we were worse. out of there like we're out of their waters yeah so it's pretty gnarly wow <clears throat> yeah how'd you sleep uh Pretty good, actually. I was, <laughs> I, I was fucking tired. I was drunk. I was drunk. I was out on the piss, mate. <laughs> Me and the right. captain started drinking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Just a couple crazy. of lonely seamen up on the top deck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it, bro. <laughs> drinking away. I heard that. Hmm? Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, I just heard seamen. <laughs> <laughs> Ears popped up. <laughs> nah, yeah, yeah. So, now, that was crazy. One of our favourite segments on the show is work fuck ups. Oh yep, 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 yep. Let's um let's cue the music. Welcome back to work fuck ups. Let's get into it. Alrighty, so <coughs> this is a pretty pretty crazy story. We're surveying and um we throw our boats off the side of the of the ship, pretty much launch them. And anyway, <coughs> we launch them and there's this new Starboard or <laughs> Bruh, shut the old. Starboard. Just listen, bro. Your, 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 your favourite. <laughs> yeah. You yeah. don't even know what the other one is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the other one? Hey, starboard Port Macquarie. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. And, and Douglas. <laughs> we're um we're surveying and, and we um we're trying to recover these boats now. And um <clears throat> So it's a pretty dangerous operation. So you have to like the crane goes down, like the big crane hook hooks up on the boat, and then you lift them up from the water. So the boat's swaying, all this stuff is swell, and and one of the the people that were um, in charge of like putting that hook where it goes was new, <clears throat> and um and but they got signed off apparently. <laughs> they, they were just signing everyone off, and um anyway they put the hook hook in fine. I was like, oh thank God. And they were trying to um, attach something else, like on the on the front of the boat. And there's this massive um, they call it like a like a staghorn. It's this big metal like pole at the at the front of the at the front of the little boat. And they end up slipping and like headbutting headbutting that uh, that big metal pole. Which is named a staghorn. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, a sure, I'm assuming it's pointy, like a. <laughs> no, no, it goes out like that, but, and I was like, oh, it was right as the waves were like hitting up, and um, like oh, is that the front thing that tied the rope? <laughs> they they had to get yeah 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 that thing yeah, and they we recovered them and stuff and took the that person took the helmet off and their teeth were like oh out, out, out of their lip and bit they bit through their teeth like unknowingly and like they had teeth missing Ooh. jaw was cracked Ooh. it was it was horrible. Lucky got freed one to lay. Kyle nil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a proper Kyle thing to do. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, so that's that's probably one of the big fuck-ups that I've seen. And oh, that wow. Gnarly, man. That might be the most gruesome one we've heard. Yeah, that's that wild. That is easily the most gruesome one we've heard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're just yeah. like, ha, 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 ha. But now it's like, ooh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ooh. Yeah, man. Ooh. Yeah, man. That was, that was pretty gnarly. Gee whiz. Mm. Any any of your own personal ones? Or you personal fuck-ups? Yeah. Let me think. What, 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 what am I willing to say? <laughs> <laughs> there must be a few. Oh, no, there's, there's, there's probably like an infinite amount. I just can't remember at the top of my head. <laughs> infinite, infinite amount. Yeah, there's, there's, really bad. there's so many. I was known for the bloke. This is how I describe myself. I was like, like, operational at best. Like, I get the job done at best, mixed with a little bit of shit cunt, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So like like every now and then I just do something to be like fucking like what the fuck was that? <laughs> so so many I just can't even remember. You know it's so funny. That's mad. Yeah man. Oh, and the music is finished. Oh, perfect. That concludes our work. Fuck ups. Fuck ups are done. Fuck ups. Hey, let's dive in 
to delve, delve, dive in, delve, dive. not navy, navy, inte- like pun intended, into your rap career. Yeah, yeah. So when <clears throat> when did this sort of fall into the to your um, timeline? Like, were you in the navy, or was it like a school passion that you had, or? Yeah, it was like a like it was it was like a school passion. Like I used to like um just like <clears throat> you know where all the black fellas used to sit at the steel tables. Yeah, yeah, yeah near tuck shop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we used to like, you know, bang on the bloody steel tables and just drop freestyles and stuff. Fuck yeah. And um yeah, so I was just real into it then, like making beats and stuff, so and everyone, you know, everyone's downloaded Garaband, see see what they can do, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So yeah. like that's I started with that and then took a little bit serious. I bought um bought like Logic Pro. Ooh. Yeah, but yeah, Logic yeah. Pro was just mucking around with everything that can do and just like so much to learn. So by then I was in the Navy and I was like m- making some tracks and stuff. Like, you know, I was like, oh, this is cool, this is cool. And at first it was just to like chill with the lads and like, you know, crack a can and chill and be like, oh, how cool is this? This is crazy. This is me. Like, what the, what the hell? Like, it sounds, <laughs> sounds weird. Like, you know, <clears throat> that's how it started. And then um, when I met my Miso, because she's in the, she was in the Navy as well. Oh, hey. Yeah, met in... Uh, recruit school Yeah That's pretty cool <laughs> Yeah yeah So yeah. I met her there She was like Pretty much a me up Like Like what are you doing You should be taking this serious Like see, see how you go And like When I was making I, I probably had like Five songs When I was in the Navy Like I was just sitting On a hard drive Sort of doing nothing Yeah Didn't have like a YouTube Didn't have a Facebook Like you know Like it, it gets, names and a digital It gets daunting doesn't it <clears throat> Yeah I like, guess you're committing You know it's, it's such like a personal Yeah It's such yeah, a personal that, that thing, a thing And you're like Fuck I don't want it like it's like podcasting is nothing making music, but like even us putting an episode out, like us talking about our whole life and you and know being vulnerable. You, you, yeah, you're it's showing a side of your personality. A lot of vulnerability, and, and too much sometimes, <laughs> especially when you're t- trying to take it serious as well. Yeah, for like sure. There's that like, oh my god, like if people don't like this, like I'm trying to take it serious, like yeah. So <clears throat> yeah, when I met my miss, she was just like, take it serious, like see where it goes, pretty much. And I never had that in my life, sort of to give everything to a passion and see how it goes. Mm. It's always been like, hey, if it don't rake in bills, like give up, like, you know, don't, don't do it, you know? So that was really good to have. Um, and I was just sort of pursuing it in the Navy at the same time. So I was like doing shows, like little shows in cans and stuff. And you're supposed to like sign all these forms and say like, I won't bring disrepute to the Navy. <laughs> and I didn't do any of that shit. <laughs> I was like, ah, oh, fuck it. I just won't tell them I was going to go fucking perform, bro. <laughs> fuck it. Like, you know, because I, I couldn't be fucked on all the paperwork and I knew I wasn't going to say anything stupid or anything like, you know. So, yeah, I did my first couple of shows and I was just learning about like music theory because like that's the big separator between like an average artist and someone who's been like a veteran for a while is like getting your head around music theory, getting a head around making vocals sound good like, yeah, and, um, sure. and spatial mixing, like, you know, mm. making sure instruments don't clash, your voice doesn't clash with a song. So many people try, put their song on, it just literally feels like their voice is stamped on the, on the track, on the audio, yeah. and it's all about learning about complementing it, you know. So that's what I was doing pretty much in Navy. And then I said if I... If I ever lined up work, I got to a point, it's like, if I line up work, like, we're, we're doing it. Like, I'm, I'm leaving Navy and I'm doing it. And um, uh, the Missos family had just started up a business. I was like, oh, we'll get their business started up. I'll, they'll keep corn in my pocket. And got I got a house. So it, was, it was pretty good. You know, it pays itself off. So, fuck it. Let's give it a crack. You yeah, know, fuck give it a nice. crack. So, that's what I've been doing. And that was a year and a half ago. So, yeah. yeah. So, um, what sort of influences did you have as a young fella, like, because that's a huge, a huge um, role in people that coming up in the music industry is mm. having like some really cool um, people to look up to. Who are you, who are you sort of listening to that sort of push you? I feel like who I looked up to was probably um, someone in Kansas who's been doing it a lot longer than me. Um, you know, Dallas. Yeah. 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 yeah DC. Yeah. yeah. He's he's probably been like yeah the barber. Yeah. Yeah, the barber, yeah, bro. He cut my hair two weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get him to cut my hair two days from now. <laughs> no, but yeah, so he was someone I really looked up to and always gave me the time of day, pretty much. Always, tr- Even though I was like, at the time that we were linking up and he was teaching me all these things, because he was, I was under his wing, he was teaching me how to mix, how to make songs, awesome, how to write mate. even, like, you know, just to get like a, a platform to start off. 
he treated me, even though like I was dog shit. I will say, like I was, I wasn't good at all. Like you know, it's pretty embarrassing thinking about it. But you all got to start somewhere. Yeah, exactly. He treated right. me like I was an equal almost, you know. And um, even though at the time, like he was really popping off, you know. Yeah. Um. Uh. So yeah, he's probably someone I really, really look up to. Yeah. Yeah, that's unreal. Yeah. Big ups, Dallas. Big ups, Dallas. Up DC. Yeah. Top bloke too, honestly. Like, <clears throat> oh, so down yeah. to earth, yeah. yeah, yeah, for what he's accomplished, yeah, yeah. So, w- what were you sort of listening to, like, what well, growing up? Yeah, uh, so that's interesting because like, mum always had like you know, old school like R and B like rap and stuff like you know, NWA was always pumping in my house. But then she'd like always have like UB Forty or reggae vibes and stuff. Bob Marley was always playing as well. UB Forty. Um, and yeah, yeah, that's probably that's probably it. Yeah, yeah. So nice. I grew up with that sort of platform. Yeah, we always loved music growing up as well. Like music's always on in the background, no matter what you're yeah. cooking. Music's on. You like, know? Yeah, yeah. Cleaning. Music's on. Like, yeah. yeah. And um, another question I had too before we get too carried away. Mm-hmm. Um, when you're making your beats, what sort of hardware do you use? Like, do you have a like a machine or? Yeah. So pretty much, I still use Logic because it's like. Industry standard, pretty much. I love it because when I started, I was like, oh, I have all the tools in front of me. Like, you know, I just need to learn how to use them. There's no, like, there's no excuse for not, you know, being able to do something. Yeah, I just got to learn how to do it. It's all in front of you. Yeah, so I, I still use Logic. And um, I got um, similar, almost like a similar setup to that. I got a dual monitor system. I got me bloody surround speakers and stuff. So when I'm mixing, I can see and hear all the frequencies yeah. and where they're coming from. Yeah. And, um, yeah. Yeah, sick. That's yeah, the guy. Because, I, yeah, I remember I was sort of same sort of thing in high school. Used You're to making like, those beats on the <coughs> beat pad? And yeah, whatnot. bro, it's literally it's right there. Behind us. It's a machine yeah. micro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got the um, I got a little beat pad as well. Yeah. yeah. It, it was just fun, like, yeah. Oh, it's so much so fun. So much fun, like. Yeah. It, it's similar to this. Just Have like, you got a beat ready for us that you've put down? Oh, oh no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Nah. I'm trying to get him to play it. Nah. <laughs> I, I, my old SoundCloud account is Braddy, still... <coughs> Braddy from the block. <laughs> it's still there, man. It's still there. It, it's good to look back on. Like, you look back and it's sort of... It's like a bit of a time capsule for me because you look 100%. back and it's like, you know, I was 16, 17 and you sort of listen to it and it's just so nostalgic. To oh, 100%. Hear back, you're like, oh, <clears throat> that was the day. I remember coming home to you listen to Fally. On Fally, your, on your bro. beat pad, oh. making beats. Like, those are, like, memories yeah. of me with you making beats for, like... Just Have you heard of Fally? Uh, he's, like, an American rapper. If I, if I heard a song, I, I'd know. You, you've got to look him up, man. He's he's so sick. Like, he hasn't really made it international, I don't think. No, he's sort of, like, underground, like, American sort of side. Like, yeah, he's, yeah. He, he's yeah. does he does big shows in America, but, yeah, yeah he's fucking deadly. Really cool. i got to search him up. Yeah. Yeah, big yeah. ups, Felly. Big ups, Felly. Big ups, I know Felly. Have a deli and some Felly later. <laughs> Felly working in the deli. <laughs> <laughs> Put some mozzarella. Oh. 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 While he's watching the telly. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm still an outrider. Oh, no, no, no. Ghost rider. <laughs> ghost rider. <laughs> Actually, speaking I, I, speaking I of up, ghost riding. Speaking of ghost riding. Oh. Have you delved into chat GPT? Delved. You're using that word now. Yeah, I like it. I I've seen all the all the clips of people doing like crazy stuff with it. It's pretty cool. It's it pretty is cool. insane. Like, I, haven't, I haven't experienced it for myself though. It's like oh, I'm hoping that one it's it potentially want to hire me. But you update your resume and you put in like some details and you're like, okay, <clears throat> this that that and write me a cover letter. And man, this thing is fucking pristine. It, it is honestly the coolest thing ever. We were playing around the other day, um, just having a laugh with the family and whatnot. And um, mm. me brother, he's a bit of a lead foot. And uh, running, running red lights. Yeah, bro. And I was like, we just made this song. I found it like a beat on YouTube, and I literally made a song in fucking like two minutes. Should we? Should we do one now? Yeah, if you want, let's go, man. Right, uh, you're you're gonna rap it, but Alex, because I'm no rapper. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't want my stock to go down. <laughs> <laughs> now we've heard Brad rap. 
Come on, man. We'll pass it around. I'll try to do a couple of lines. For someone whose Instagram name is Notorious BMG. Oh, come on, man. That's not right. Because I I knew you were coming on today. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I I wrote a little line down. It's literally one line. Oh, yeah, go, go, go. It's a naughty line. If you've got like an angry voice. Ready? Listen to this. Yeah, I'm a felony, but you look like you fell on knees. Say it again, say it again, say it again, say it again, say it again. Yeah, I'm a felony, but you look like you fell on knees. Ooh. Yeah. Chuchi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ch- Chat GVT is live. Okay, so I'm going to say, write a rap about... Chuchi. Give me some, give me some, some rant, anything. It, just give me anything. Um, about getting a job. About... Getting on a ship, a job on a ship, on a ship. <laughs> yeah, heading to Shipwreck Cove. <laughs> heading to ship. Oh, shit! shit. <laughs> <laughs> Cove. shit. All right, brass. <coughs> this is pressureful. I'm glad I'm not Ooh, rapping. Yeah, are you nervous? Oh, what do you mean? No, no, no. <laughs> Oh, look, it's writing, it's writing it. Yeah, bro. It literally writes it in front. You got to wrap it that fast, though. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> can you show the camera? Oh yeah, I'll um. Too late. <laughs> it's done. Nah, it's still going. Okay, I just oh my need to. Okay, let's. What What are you feeling? Like a old school hip hop beat, or like a Migos beat, or what you, are you, you feeling? You go, you go old school hip hop. I'll, okay. I'll, I'll try read it out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not on the spot. <laughs> I'll, I'll give it a crack. I'm not. I'm nah, not you got reading. this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it a crack. All I'll right. tell you what. This might be a cool little like Twitch sort of feature you could try out. Try it. Oh. oh. How's this sound for you? Yeah. Yeah. Xander's in the house. Chat GBT rap. Bitches. <laughs> I'm searching for a job and I need it quick. But not just any job, I want to be on a ship. Hey. Head in Shipwreck Cove, that's where the treasure's yeah. lead. I'll do it whatever it takes, I want to be outbid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll swap the decks and I'll climb the mast. I'll hold the anchor and I'll raise the flag. I'll look out. I'm the man on the helm. I'll do whatever it takes to get that realm. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. So this is the chorus, right? This is the chorus, apparently. Wait, wait, wait. Here it is, here it is. Sailing to Shipwreck Cove. That's where I want to be. On the ship full of treasure. That's the life for me. You're my life for me. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. You're my treasure. Ooh, treasure. Yeah, you're my treasure. <laughs> you're my treasure. <laughs> Pulling up out. <laughs> oh, that was super hard, though, man. Yeah. Oh my god, that was hard. Yeah, oh, that, that sounded so good hard to do. That man. sounded good. How amazing is that? That's ridiculous, yeah. actually. Like, when it first when it when I hit the first like two lines and it rhymed, I was like, "Holy shit!" That's oh pretty damn! Cool, man. Yeah, I know. Um, watching it right is weird, man. Yeah, because like like verses and beep, chorus, beep, the way beep, it's beep, coming beep, up, beep. yeah, and it, it labels it verse and stuff. That's really yeah. neat. It is fucking phenomenal. Um, I know Tash Sultana. She she did an Instagram post um about it saying like how it's sort of ruining the music industry, like AI, because it, Ooh, there is apps. Because can you copyright it and just sing that or no? Nah? Yeah. I see Look out, world. <laughs> <laughs> MC Hello, world. world. Yeah. That's the place I want to be. <laughs> <laughs> Safest digital here. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Yeah, because I think there is AI that does, um, it puts like chord progressions and stuff together. That So yeah, you yeah, could yeah, honestly yeah. make a full song with AI. Yeah, there wild. is, there is. I've, <coughs> yeah, I've seen like um, YouTubers that I follow, they like have these, like AI engines and stuff, and you can literally see it. It's crazy. Like you just, boom, chord progression, boom, occupied the bloody song instantly. Anything, anything. You pick the key and like the vibe, and it, it goes straight in. It's same thing for drums, drums, occupy it. You say same vibe, boom. Now they have things that can write lyrics, and they also have um, pretty much like deep fake audio now. And um, <clears throat> David Guetta has a song that's called like, I think it's like, not Slim Shady or something. And, like, he has – it's, like, AI 
Slim AI Eminem wow. on his song, and he previewed it at like a festival, and um, and it's like when I first listened to, it, I was like, oh, that's, oh wow, he got Eminem on the track, and I was looking at the like the um the beneath feature. beneath it, I was like, oh, hang on, that's AI, because the amount of words Eminem would spat out, they just get his voice from the words he said that's online. Yeah, well, I think the main thing is that they analyze it. Yeah, analyze mm. all the content that's out there of him. And then it'll have like freestyles, acapellas, stems that are out there on the internet. That's there's no beat in the background, and they can analyze it even better. Yeah, and then put that's it out. wild. Because there's yeah, a full man. podcast of Joe Rogan talking about monkeys or something. <laughs> yeah, with, <laughs> with with Elon Musk, and I was listening to it. It was like the most craziest shit. And I remember I was like, and, and it started like talking about all these like weird products, and they were trying to sell it. And, and I was listening to it, and I was like, like hang on, this sounds joke. like a scam. How are they doing this? And then, like, looked at the comments and like, yeah, wow, this AI voice stuff is ridiculous. Like, I thought this was real. I was like, I still think it's real. What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, bro, they fooled me for so long. It was like three minutes into the video. I was like, oh, my God. Would you ever write a song on AI? <clears throat> um, That's a disrespectful question. I, I, I don't know. Is it? I think, I think it might It might be good for if you have, like, writer's block. Writer's block, yeah. Writer's block is a big thing. And then like, you copy the homework, but just change it a little bit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like but you have, the same, you have the same answers, but... <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I don't know. I think it'd be good for writers' work, but I haven't really. I think I'd. What I'd like to do, if, if I'm honest, what I probably will do is like I'll have a crack using it just to see what will come out. Yeah, and I'll be full transparent. Like I might yeah. film it and just see if you can write a better song than me. Like you know. Yeah. But I mean, at the stage that it's at now, it's not like groundbreaking bars. You know no, what I mean? it's not like yeah, yeah, holy yeah. fuck. It's, it's nothing too crazy. Yeah, yeah. No, no, but no. it's only brand new, and it's only going to get smarter. And that's just um, what's that chat? Chat GPT. Yeah, yeah. So that's just that. Um, there's other AI lyric websites that are just for writing lyrics, oh, and they're, wow. and they're like a thousand times better. Yeah, holy. it's like write me a, a Drake verse, and it'll be like. Within this style, my ex broke up with me, and I'm drinking the Girl. XO. <laughs> Keep some playing games. <laughs> L- literally, bro. Literally, um, but it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. I there is a voice AI that remember we we downloaded one, Maddie, for you, your yeah, computer. That's right. Yeah, yeah. And you can upload your own audio and get your own AI uh, voice changer. It's voice change IO. It's called. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. And you can do it live. We're going to try and do it on the show. Like, they've got, like, Conor McGregor and Donald Trump and... Conor fucking McGregor. Oh, no, no, no. Fuck the Mayweather's. I've seen that. I've seen that. Yeah. You, and it you record crazy. your own voice, upload it, and you can change, yeah. like, Barack Obama or... Or Jordan B. And, and analyze and, and it. Anyone, yeah. 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 And you can hear it live. We're going to... We're probably going to try and do an episode with one. Like, just oh, yeah. fucking around. That'd, That'd be, be mad. Funny. That'd be ridiculous. Yeah. I've always wanted to suss those out as yeah. well. Yeah. Like, you see people do it on stream and stuff. Mm. And it was like, the sound like... It's like... You know that streamer I show speed? Yeah. yeah. Oh, he got, so he, he, got, he got Oh yeah, he's so funny. He got um he got one who sound like Joe Biden. <laughs> <laughs> he's this little black kid man with crazy hair sounded like an old white man. <laughs> it's so funny, bro. Oh, that's sick. Oh man. So good. Yeah. So what's next, Xander? Where are we going? What are we doing music wise? What do <coughs> we got wise, lined up? So one and a half years I've been down south just getting gigs and stuff, trying to trying to build that portfolio, trying yep. to build the brand, trying to trying to gain more confidence and do do stuff out of the out of the regular. And yeah, build a portfolio of performances pretty much. And um now I'm up here back in Cairns and I'm trying to bring that energy, all that experience back here and yeah, and, and take it around Australia pretty much yep. and, and this is gonna be like the sort of home base. Yeah, nice. Very cool. Yeah, got a got a gig um, at the Jack. Twenty fifth at the Jack. Oh, yeah. hey. Should be good. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> I like that. I like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that should that should be pretty good. Um, I'm performing uh, the album. Yeah, Rogue live. Oh, yeah. Man. Nice, so very just, nice. Yeah, we yeah. better be there. Yeah, you boys should come. Yeah. Have to come. I think yeah. I'm going to be in Bali, unfortunately, but these boys will be there. Yeah, we'll be there. Oh, that'd be sick. Luke will be there too. Yeah, we'll hold down the fort. Yeah. yeah that'd be on good. starboard that'd be good. bow we'll be and. Holding hands and clenching together. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone yeah. in the front row is going like this, right? <laughs> We're going to ruin the show. Everyone in the whole crowd is going to be clenching hands. Well, uh, Santa Digital has some really weird fans. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's weird. It doesn't sound like his songs are about that sort of stuff. <laughs> 
You should oh, sing man. that song. <laughs> <laughs> sing your chat GPT song off on stage. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, that'd be deadly. <laughs> I'll get a couple of bloody tomatoes thrown at me, I reckon. <laughs> So talking about the can scene, is there anything different between the can scene and like the southern scene? That's a really good question. Are they <coughs> Oh, Matty. <laughs> that's a really good about time. time today. About time, Matthew. That's a... Re- that's a <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I didn't mean like that, bro. No, I just... Um, it's because like there were huge differences. And I feel like in cans, where I've performed, I've done, I've done a few in cans, but I, I won't tell what, like what event or anything. But usually like... People, when you go to do a sound check before the event starts, so you make sure all your levels are okay, they're like, oh, yeah, look at your mic and stuff. Oh, that song's a bit louder. You need a, you know, a bit more of this, a bit more of that. <clears throat> when you go to the sound check, like, everyone has their entourages and stuff, like, you know. And so, like, I'm, I'm pretty humble, and I've always been humble, and I, I plan on always staying like this. So me and the miso just rock up. We're like, i got my little backpack on with my hard drive in there. <clears throat> and, you, you know, you rock up, and everyone's like, it's like nighttime. You know, it's like 6.30 p.m. night time. Everyone's wearing sunglasses and they got their massive chains on and stuff and they don't talk to you. And, you know. Two and chains. Yeah, literally. <laughs> the chain. I was just like, oh, okay. Like, you know. Um, and you go out there, you kill it, and then everyone comes up to you afterwards and yeah. wants the yarn. Signature Sonic yeah. Babies. <laughs> no, no. Sonic Babies. Sonic Babies. No, nothing. Sonic Babies. <laughs> nothing like that. Um, but the last one, I had people taking photos of me. That was cool. That's like, pretty cool. And um, yeah. Ethan and Jimmy were there, and that was the first gig that they rocked up to. That was the first time that's happened as well, but they thought that was a stand. They're like, bro, who the fuck are you? <laughs> 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 yeah, this, is, this happens all the time. I was like, nah, bro, this one's a special one. But, um, but yeah, and whereas down south, like, everyone's a lot more humble. Everyone's a lot more chill. Everyone's a lot more, like... Really? Yeah. You think it'd be the other way around. That's what I thought. Like, that's what, that's what I thought. Because, like, oh, big city people, like, nah, man. Yeah. Like, everyone that just so laid back, chill, accepting, come up to you, yarn, like, you know, oh, where are you? Like, you know, at, with your performance journey, is this your, you know, what number gig is this for you? Like, mm. yeah, come up to you, they want to know more about you. Yeah, that's, that's, mo- that, yeah, it's a spin out. Because you think cans, like, of all places, is very laid back. Full of flogs. And they rock up thinking they're deadly. That, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 that the competition. I was yeah. like, the, the deadly part, like you know, was like, yeah. So I just thought that was standard, like you know, you just got to sort of show them what you're capable of and stuff, and then they start talking to you. But yeah, it went down south. It was re- completely different. It was refreshing. It was good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you're saying Chini and I should rock up with chains on, and like baggy <laughs> yeah. clothes? Right. Can yeah, we be your full on sun <laughs> fucking visors, Can we bro? be your entourage? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The boys, couple of fucking. Yeah. Yeah. Y2B, Can you Y2B? buy me another Supreme hat? Yeah. Oh, maybe. There we go. <laughs> maybe. I <have> buy it. <laughs> couple beefcake bodyguards for you, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys, got to wear all black too. You gotta yeah. look like uh, was it Agent Smith? Both of you. <laughs> I want to be Agent Bubbles from <laughs> Lilo and Stitch. Lilo and Stitch. <laughs> Bubbles, bro. Holy, we'll be able to protect you for thirty seconds, then we get asthma. Yeah, we do. <laughs> but that's so funny. No, nah, but yeah, yeah. So that's that's a big difference, and I noticed as a good question because um yeah, I, I, that's what I tell everyone yeah when I come back. Yeah, and I don't think we even mentioned this, but man, your music is fucking insane. Like, oh, thanks, man. It's it's not even like, <clears throat> oh, this is my mate. I'm listening to music. It's like this shit's on my fucking playlist. And if no one's picked up yet, it's our outro. <laughs> <as well>. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's actually a privilege to have like yeah. more music on the outro. Like every time we play the outro, we're just dancing. It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's so good. Yeah, so yeah. No, thanks, sir. No, it's, it's really good. No, usually I'm too hard on myself. I don't really relish in, like, oh, yeah, I guess I'm making good music. Like, you're just like, next thing, next thing, next thing. Yeah, like, trying, okay. to, trying to be better, yeah. trying to hone. The new album's sick, too. Man. Oh, thanks, man. We've, Thank got a, we've actually got a bit of a fucking treat for the listeners. What have we got? Well, oh, tell look, me. Look. I can't wait another second. <laughs> 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 Should I? Oh. Uh, Xander's new track, Rogue Freestyle. It is a fucking bopper of a track. Go on. It is like, it just really, I picture myself cruising down the Esplanade with the windows down with some big thick sunnies on just fucking looking at everyone, just bopping away. It's a good one. It's, it's a, good a one. vibe, bro. <coughs> it is how, a I, how I wrote that was pretty interesting as well. So like pretty much I was doing delivery driving down there to hold myself down sort of, you know, with the family, uh, Miso's family business. 
And like as I was driving, I just think of like the random like one liners that this like IG captions pretty much like you know hard as. So I'd like pull over, write it down in a notepad, and keep going. And anyway, six months went past, and like I was like, oh, like let's let's try put this on like all on one track. Let's see how it goes. And <clears throat> like you know, I just put in the sort of linking sort of stuff, and um, and all the energy was very similar. So I was like, oh fuck it, like so all this these like amazing sick one-liners like i blended them all into one song and that's what rogue freestyle is yeah yeah it's like it's funny that all of these one-liners have come from you while you're driving because i feel like it's a proper like behind the wheel fucking yeah, tough as fuck, yeah, eh? bro, like, yeah that's weird eh? that is that is crazy that's yeah. Like, yeah when you when you said you were like oh you're just cruising shades on yeah, yeah man yeah yeah um well we've got a very fucking special performance from our main man let's go we've got the track lined up we're getting the fucking live performance. Man, I got fucking goosebumps. Can I have some of that, please? I need some of that. We're ready. <laughs> <laughs> let's go, let's go. Literal goosebumps, my man. ZD, baby. He's God, bro. Nice, oh, man. That's man. <laughs> you turn up a little bit? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. That's sick. Almost the man podcast. Let's go. We got Brad George, Matt George, we got Chinny, let's get it, yeah, ayy Smith and Weston, just like the gun, I'm a motherfucking weapon Call me Santa cause I gifted the reunion up in heaven Shorty eat a dick like a sandwich with the devil Shorty moving me in ways with that brain like 11, yeah, like 11 I've been making beats, smacking on tables since 7 Yeah, I wasn't good at school, but I learned a lot of lessons A lot of regression, self-expression was the key to my progression If I see him around, put a round in his head Pussy boy gon' hit the ground like the round Cause he dead, then I'll be telling all his boys How he cried when he bled, yeah This the type of shit that gets you wanna buy the feds Not the fucking baker, but you know I'm getting red Just a young baller dream chasing, trying to get ahead when you gonna quit, boy, that's the day I dread Same day I quit is the say day I'm dead And the shorty's like my flow, it's like the snow I'm too cold with it, jackets in my phone They trying to know where your boy's headed I just told them they should know a Grammy Yeah, your boy gon' get it Picturing that gold in my hands Yeah, that boy done did it Yeah, ay, 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 yeah, yeah Chuch. Oh, Mr. Man Podcast, let's Chuchy. get it Hey, Chuchy, yeah, I'm feeling yeah. it Oh shit, dropped in, top 10, locked in That's what I'ma be, just wait and see when I'ma drop this Everybody wanna know what's up And I'm shocked when they tryna tell me that my time is up But I've been working CD is the GOAT, that's what I told them Now they shook, yeah they knew that I had something But you didn't even look And now they ask about the past and what past CD took I know you mad, I just laugh Cause you can't find this in a book Your life been way too easy You've been running from your problems In my life I had no choice I couldn't run, I had to solve them While you were getting Comfy on your couch, I was starving. Now I own a fucking house. There ain't no obstacles or problems. Let's fucking go, boys. Oh, let's awesome man go. podcast. I see. Woo! <laughs> I got goosebumps bro. on my fingers somehow. <laughs> Let's go, let's go. Oh, that was fucking incredible. That was nah, awesome. Thanks, that was, that was fucking boys. sick. Nah, thanks, boys. Can't wait to, can't wait oh. to do it uh, live again for you, fellas. Yeah. And Jack, let's yeah, get can't it. Can't wait to be there, yeah. Oh, fucking yeah, awesome. fucking that was a rogue freestyle. I want to buy CD on a CD. <laughs> 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 Better write that one right now. <laughs> <laughs> Just from here to <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, boys. Oh, man, didn't that get the fucking blood pumping? Bro, that was good as that was good. Oh, that was so much fun. That was mad. I'm oh, oh, so sick. That was so I fucking wanna sick. I want to cry. <laughs> <laughs> that was so fucking Holy sick. Holy shit. No, cheers, lads. Cheers, lads. Yeah. No, it's good. Uh, I forget how much it bumps me. Like, wear it with headphones and listen. Like, yeah. I Holy. You look, I was, like, dancing like a... And then I looked over. Oh, I should have said that. <laughs> and, you, and you look like and you look like a gangster. And then I had to swap it up to ooh 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 bang bang gun gun gang gang gang. Bro. You had to change the brand real quick, bro. <laughs> uh, oh, that's that is my number one podcast moment we've ever done. Oh, thanks, boys. That was good. That's, bro, that's, that's it. So that was sick, boys. Where do we go from there? <laughs> That's it. Quit. <laughs> <laughs> We're done. That's all she wrote. 
no, no, no. Thanks, man. That was, that was the first for me as well, guys. That was sick. That was yeah. Man. Look, we yeah, we appreciate you coming on, brother, and um, and appreciate the support you've given us since day one, bro. Like, oh, 100%. Yeah, yeah. Before we even started the podcast, he was yeah. in the outro. Yeah, outro track, which we're yeah, almost to about us. to hear. But, um, yeah, we love seeing what you're doing, bro. Keep fucking grinding. And, yeah, don't forget us when you're fucking making squillions, bro. Oh, never, boys. Never, never. <laughs> never. He's, never. he's <laughs> humble, but don't forget. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, it's fine. I'm a stoke over here. I'm a stoke over here. Do you want to quickly plug your shows real quick? Yeah. You're the fan. Plug, plug your show real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, yes, the Jack, 25th. Uh, Get there. Get there. Doors Fucking open. Be 8, there or be 8 square. PM. Let's go and stream new album Rogue. Xander Digital, Spotify, Spotify. on all platforms. Let's get it. We're gonna share it on our page too. If you're fucking retarded and you can't search it yourself, plug your Twitch too. Yeah, plug your socials. Yeah, Let's Twitch. go. Xander Digital. Xander oh. Digital. <laughs> get behind him and thanks for getting behind us. Almost a man podcast. We love yous. Let's go. Woo. Let's go. Another fire track. This is sick. Have you heard this, bro? Give it from the dump to make us something to say. I'ma pull up to the clay and steal your babe. Rip the CNS all day. All day. Rip the CNS all day.